Now, finally, uh, we're going to have a little chat about the file explorer. I never made a video about it. Uh, it's pretty much uh, a simple file explorer, but it does work really well with some limitations. File explorer, you start from the menu here, file manager. And these are all the app files available uh, in different uh, folders. Here you'll find your shorelines. You, if you press the top pair on the folder, it will go back. Here are the depth logs. And here we have the depth map that we created. The buttons on top here, there are your help. If you long press on it, it will display the ability. So the right one is share. Then we have the rename. Then we have the copy. Then we have the delete. And we also have a zip to backup. We're going to talk about all of these. First of all, we just made a map here. And let's share it. And let's do it by email. So I'm going to share that. And it's going to bring up uh, the menu uh, for what you can share to us. So I'm going to do it by email. I'm going to press that. See, that's my name. And I have uh, my map. And you press send up here. And you're done. Rename is pretty much straightforward. You just press the TT and you can select a new name for it. And the uh, file will be renamed. I can also copy it and it's going to make this copy. And if I select it, I can delete it. You get a warning after the delete is OK, then it's lost forever. And I have a, quite a lot of depth logs here. And maybe I want to transfer these to another tablet, or maybe I just want to keep them safe in case I lose my tablet or I destroy it, and then all of my depth logs are gone forever. Right now, I haven't selected any file at all, but I still have one icon left here. And if we long press it, it says zip files to backup. And what's going to happen here is when I press this button, it's going to create a zip file of everything that's in this folder and bring up the share to dialog. I'm going to do it once more with mail. I'm going to send it to myself. And this is backup. Depth log zips. In addition to that, the backups you have created, they are now available in the backup folder. Let me go into shorelines. There are not that many files here. I'm going to delete all of them. Now, these shorelines I have actually done a backup from before i sent it an email then in addition to that i should also have them in my onedrive so here they are already selected i have a backup here and when i'm going to restore it i need to use the share button uh, onedrive is uh, a little peculiar so when i share you need to make sure you send files and not a link. I'm going to do send files and I'm going to share it with the CarPilot Pro. So I click that and that will bring up the file manager of the back of the CarPilot Pro. And I'm now restoring shorelines. I'm going to select shorelines here. And then we have this plus button, which makes it possible for you to add the files in this folder. I'm just going to push this once, and there are the shorelines. If I now go back, then I'm back here, and I'm done. 
So let me bring up the Carpada Pro. And show lines. Now here's the zip file. Now if you click this zip file, if you click any zip file, you get another item here. So long press on that. It's gonna say unzip files here. So just press this once and your files are all restored. Then I'm gonna take that zip file. I'm gonna delete it because I don't need it anymore. And then I'm good to go. So my files are now restored on the same tablet or perhaps you have many tablets. This is a way to transfer all your files to that other tablet. So we're done here. Let's put this map back. We renamed it to test two in the file manager. And there we are back where we started this video.